the concept here was to do something that had never been done before, to marry extreme luxury and sustainability, which were uh, heretofore considered mutually exclusive. There are a lot of very green hotels around the world, but there are none of the same quality and caliber that this hotel is in terms of providing an extraordinarily luxurious and comfortable environment. So we started planning the hotel in earnest in uh, 2004 and 5, and um, we knew we wanted to name it after the Bartosono family, who are still the landlords, by the way. They, they own the land here, and we lease it from them in an annual ground lease. But we developed the property at an extraordinary cost. Um, it ended up costing about a million dollars per room, all in. And a lot, some of that cost was in the um, Building to Lead Platinum Certification. The U.S. Green Building Council will certify your, your new building as very green. And we wanted to shoot for the moon and go for the highest certification there is. And we did. And we opened in February of 2009. When we were awarded LEED Platinum Certification in March of 2010, it achieved our goal of being the greenest luxury hotel in the United States. The concierge really prides themselves on creating everything customized. We don't have any cookie cutter itineraries. We don't have a su general suggested list. Uh, we do have preferred wineries and restaurants that we love guests to visit, but really we want to get to know the guests, understand if they've been here before, what kind of experience they're looking for, and really cater a full itinerary to them based on what they're going to want to do and what they will like while they're here. And our pr premier partner that we started a strategic alliance with uh, back in 2009 is the Bartizona Hotel. And we feel extremely privileged to work with them. It's a 62-room boutique hotel that fits in so nicely to the Hill Family Estate philosophy. When we have guests that are visiting and they love the, the essence of family, hands-on, attention to detail, they find that right down the street, just a Tiger Woods chip shot down Washington Street off Yacht. And they find that at this little oasis that exists in downtown Yachtville. And the one unique advantage that the Bartizono has is that they have the ultra luxury lifestyle, but you can walk out your front door and you're right next to the French Laundry, Bouchon Bakery, Red Restaurant, as well as an array of different tasting rooms and shops. We built extraordinary guest rooms and we built each bathroom to be a spa treatment room. So the feeling of the hotel is very spacious, a little bit minimalist, um, and that is out of sensitivity to the environment in terms of not a lot of fabric. Blinds on the outside which keep the temperature of the room, keep it in the room so you're not using a lot of energy. Heating or cooling based upon whether it's sunny outside or whether it's dark outside. But some of the major environmental initiatives were the 972 solar panels, generating about 40% of our, our needs around electricity. The concrete that we used had ash. The wood that we used, a lot of the cypress you see in the exterior of the hotel, as well as the walnut in the furniture, was all down wood. No trees were cut down to build this place. I think it's a, it's a really fun place to be. We've got a great team. There's, a, there's an amazing amount of talent, um, and we're always focused on the best ingredient. You know, we're literally harvesting. The kitchen is the gardeners. Everyone always asks, well, who takes care of the garden? Well, we do. So we're getting the freshest ingredients, the best ingredients, a beautiful atmosphere, a great team, uh, just to come and enjoy and relax and, and really experience the Napa Valley in a casual, fun way. Uh, we've designed the menu so that, you know, we don't have a tasting menu anymore. We've designed it so you can have a full or a half portion of anything and kind of create your own or we can create it for you. So you're not stuck to anything. If you don't like certain things, we'll work with you and really work with what's in the dining room and what's in the garden. You know, we spend a lot of time, a lot of phone calls, um, extensive emails. We really get to know the guest to start everything off, to take in, you know, what they're looking for. Our goal is to want them to return. Our goal is to want them to use our service again. Um, we are a luxury hotel and resort, and we want them to want more of Napa. We want them to come back longing to visit more wineries, have more dining experiences, and really develop a passion for the Napa Valley.